Hi guys, this is very cute cemetery in south east of South Australia called Sherlock. It doesn't look like anyone's been here for quite a while. The gate was a bit hard to open and the latch has fallen down there. So let's go in. There is a register of burials at the council apparently and I haven't read it so I know nothing. This headstone is gone, obviously. Imperial forces and those bricks, child's bricks, are from Little Hampton. And that's the name of the road that the Little Hampton Brickworks is on, Child's, because of Mr. Child's apparently. Okay, there's two unnamed. That one, you could see something that says his father, sisters and Eileen. wonder where the rest of it is. It's not like something would pick it up and carry it away. Okay, this is for W.J. Tiller, 48 Battalion, 16th of January 1921. It's an armed forces one, it's an Australian Imperial Force. This is Clary Ball, she was 10. So these are markers, they look relatively new and that's great. Somebody's come out here and done that in their honor. Ella Crouch, she was one day old and Clary was 10, if I didn't say that. It's a very interesting one up behind there because it's my family name, one of my family names. I'll zoom in on this one, this is John Slengen, S-L-E-N-G-E-N. -E he was 40 years old when he died in 1940. And this was put here by his friends, the A-V-L-E-S family, it looks like. And he was from Norway. The surname here is Arbon. Now somebody has gone over this in gold paint texture. It's not great but a lot of these red granite ones with that lichen or moss on them are unreadable and we can read this because they've done that. Arben, Hazel, Annie, loved wife of Raymond Victor and mother of Ronald and she was only 20 years old when she died in 1942. say there Arbon family what's like Warner family on the other one okay it's a bit of a more modern one here 2019 the surname of Thorpe and this huge bit of stone I think it is Heinrich for Carl and Emma 1942 and 1959. A marker for Anna Wolf, aged 81. In 1915 she was buried, or oh, there is something in here. In memory of Wilhelm Hensel, he died in 1918, aged 76, and his wife Christiani, Christiani Hensel, and their son. And the wife was 1933, and the sun was 1942. And here's another Hensel, Herman Wilhelm Hensel, 1942, age 74. Is that the whole headstone? It looks a bit strange, doesn't it? Hmm, interesting. And Mary Ann Saunders, 88, 1936. So that's the whole cemetery. You can see it's in the middle of the bush. And if we just now go back over to these ones in the middle, I'm sure there's ones probably all across there as well. 
this is 2016. Eileen, the twin daughter of Winifred and Alfred Cubank. I'm assuming that's 2016. And this one here, this beautiful stone, 